When I would look in the mirror, I saw nothing looking back at me. There was an emptiness inside of me, a deep sadness. It was a very dark world. When I first entered the hospital, my husband was like the proverbial you know, deer in the headlights. Um, this is pretty scary, and he said, I'm the one who's always taking care of everyone and everything, and it was a role reversal. I felt that I was always treated with compassion and dignity and respect. I received what I feel was the best treatment that out there. Without those people and my uh, talk therapy people, I wouldn't be here today. I honestly feel that way. But until I started talking with other patients, I did not realize the shame that was attached to it. Well, I rely on faith that I am helping someone else. I, I look at it, there has to be a reason this happened, uh, other than medical reasons. And so I, I just hope that somewhere along the line that I'm helping someone else and that I will help break that stigma. I think this new behavioral health unit is a big step. Uh, it shows people with mental illness is being treated on an equal level, that they deserve to have a new environment. I'm excited for the community that, that Gunderson Ruthen has decided to go forward with this and, and provide help for more people. I have been uh, receiving my medical care here for nearly 60 years. My mother was a nurse here. Um, it's home to me, so I, I just feel that it's the place to come to get the medical care you need.